Hey, 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 what's up everyone? It's Kaz with State of Decay Breakdown. When we last left off, we finished quite a few missions and we killed quite a few special infected. So I think today we are going to start out by going up here and clearing out some infestations. I'm hoping that it becomes daylight soon uh, because I'd rather do these missions up in Spencer's Mill in the daytime but beggars can't be choosers and let's get a nice loadout so that we can go up there and clear up all of these infestations so we're gonna hit up the supply locker and we are going to take out some more fire and some of these and maybe some more fire I think that should uh, be sufficient what about my gun hmm I think that should be good enough let's go get a nice truck and we're not even going to take a companion we will just go up there solo and I can see that the sun is coming up, so this is perfect time to head up to Spencer's Mill and clear those infestations. That's good to know, Lily. But I will say this, as soon as I get out of range of my home base, I am quite sure I'll start getting pinged for missions, morale missions, and crazy things like that. So. Let us go and take these uh, morning hours when the sun is just coming up to drive up to Spencer's Mill. And hopefully by the time we arrive at Spencer's Mill, we will be in the daylight. So we're just going to drive, drive, drive. This is my um, shortcut up to Spencer's Mill as we go through the farmland. And of course, as, as, as you should do for any time during the game, don't flip your truck. I spend a lot of time carefully driving. Uh, you never should stop driving carefully. You will always need to watch what you're doing and where you're going because it's really important that you don't hit a rock or you know the crazy physics in this game will flip a truck for any reason you see exactly like I said as, as soon as I leave home base all of a sudden there's missions that spawn so what we want to do here is go up and clear these infestations as quickly as possible uh, that sometimes is not... Uh, sometimes the game doesn't cooperate, so... It's not as easy as it sounds. So the first one here is... Looks like the gun shop. Which is great, because I can go in there and... Um, scavenge it as well. Get the hell out of there. Let's just aggro them. Now that's a two level complex, so I don't know if pipe bombing it is going to work. At least I'm not sure if it's going to work as well as I want it to. Oh, these are all the stragglers, so these are all the stragglers. From closing the door so let's clean these up let's clean these guys up quick quick and that takes care of them and I think I'm gonna do this quietly which means go in and kill things manually Thanks so much for that idea So much for that idea, huh? Let's 
There's another one, maybe another two. Maybe another screamer in here. Oh Jesus, guys, come on. Sorry, uh, that was pretty intense. I don't know what's going on here. It seems like I'm getting attacked like crazy. Oh, that's nice. Seems like I'm gonna get attacked like crazy in here. Really, guys? Really? Are there more upstairs? Is there a feral in here, maybe? I don't know, but let me close this back door. Looks like an infestation. I told you they were on the second floor, so. So let's get some fire. Right? Is that what we need? Some fire? Or I just need to shoot this guy in the head. Well, that's not gonna work. Clear the infestation? Damn. It's a lot of work. Ah, <sighs> what do I want here? What do I want? I don't want anything. What about in here? That should do it. Okay, so that cleared that one up. Wow, and I got really hurt. And this is really the reason why I don't, I don't melee. You know, that ruined my whole trip. See? It ruined the whole trip. Now I have to go back and uh, switch out, switch weapons, switch everything. The better you just run everything over. The, the, the truck is more durable than your body is. What else am I missing? Is there some sort of ammo cache or something? Cause I'm gonna take this. Nice. I'm also gonna take the ammo. Okay, here it is. Cause we're heading back now. This guy is hurt. So we're heading back. I have to get a new shovel. This was a bad trip. So for me, this was a bad trip, but at least we cleared the infestation. And I'll be honest, I'm thinking I'm just going to clear the next one, too. Why not, right? Where's the next one? Over here, down the street? And if I could just... Fling a pipe bomb in there, maybe? Get rid of these guys first. I don't want to lose this shovel, guys. I really don't. I don't want to lose this shovel. It's really a one-of-a-kind shovel. Okay, let's get out of here. Damn, I'm tired. Well, that's gonna go badly for me. Oh, 
Okay, so this is a little thing you do. Okay, well, let's just get to the car, guys. I think it's time to get to the car. Before a feral pops out, or, or just this just doesn't go well. Sorry, Evan. I always get Evan hurt. I just take liberties with him, like he's uh, almost indestructible, and really he's not. So that, that did not go well for me, because once again, I abused Evan. And I'm still thinking there's time for me to go... Ah, look, I wiped it out. I still think there's time for me to go and get the last one. I'm convinced I can do the last one. Where was that uh, juggernaut? Where was he? I heard him, but I didn't see him. I see him climbing. Yeah, there he is. He's in the Kirkman residence. Do you see him up there? He's going to come after me. Let him come after me. Yeah, let him come after me. I'm okay with that. Come on, big guy. Come on, fat boy. See, he can't come after me. He's stuck up there. Well, not really. What do you say, fat boy? How's this? Watch. How's that? I think I aggroed everything in the area. I think I aggroed everything in the area with the pipe bomb. And look, there's a, a bloaty bloat. Thankfully, no ferals. No ferals. The bloater is, is going to be a pain in the ass, but... Where is the juggernaut right now? Where is he? He's my primary threat. Where'd he go? So I know he's not dead. Now he's dead. Can we go clear that other infestation? Let me try it. I know Evan's hurt and we're in a in a bad way, but Oh, there's two more. Ah. That could be bad. That could be bad. And if I uncover more of them, it'll be even worse. So, let me get a pipe bomb. And really, I can't afford to be... Uh, I can't afford to be um, attacked. There's a pipe bomb in the front in the front door. That was a pipe bomb right in the front window, right in the living room, and I didn't kill them all. I think it's these guys here I'm gonna need to kill, and then that'll be the end of this infestation. Yep. Okay, one more. Can we do this one before I head back? Oh, it's a public restroom, which is really sometimes a bitch. Let's go around this way. And into the parking lot. Where can these guys be? Where can these guys be? I don't like that. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to throw a pipe bomb in the utility closet right here. Oh, watch out. Where the hell do these bloaters come from? Really, guys? They just pop up out of nowhere. Uh. So many spawns. It's so many spawns. They just come out of nowhere. Yeah, well, get off the car, because I'm out. We got four more bullets. Four more bullets. 
let's get this horde too. Yeah, I know. Because I can't afford to be ambushed from the from the rear by a horde. That'd be the worst thing ever. Oh shit, more bloaters, man. I can't get away from bloaters. I mean, I like the idea of killing special infected, but Jesus, bloaters. And they got four bullets. No, no, I can't. I don't have time to deal with you guys. Sorry, I don't. I have a broken weapon. I'm hurting. I'm far away from home. It, it's, it's nighttime instead of daytime because I misjudged that whole deal. So <laughs> I'm really not doing too well. Um, I'm just a mess today. I'm just a mess. Okay, so what I'm planning to do here is to throw a pipe bomb in this little room here. Nope. Because I think that's going to kill them, and then I can clean up all of the stragglers. And that'll be all these infestations. Yep. Right? And what we want to do now is get the hell out of Dodge before I discover more infestations. So we are out of here. And we're heading back to Marshall. And damn, that was definitely crazy. That was crazier than I thought it would be. Uh, the gun shop was a real, real, real pain in the ass. I gotta say, the gun shop, we almost died. Well, not really. But had I been uh, brought to my knees one more time, uh, I think I would have died. And that would have been my chemical expert. Uh, Evan is a really important member. So dying, uh, him dying would have been a really big blow to my squad. So we don't want to let him die. And we're going to run, run, run back to Marshall. Park this car to get it fixed. And put Evan into the infirmary because he's hurt. And he always gets hurt when I play with him. So we're going to come into Marshall soon. Here's the roadway. And we are going to go there and pick up another character. Now someone said I can push the cars back to home base. I'm wondering. Can I push this car all the way back to home base? I doubt it, but I'm going to try. I take some it takes some practice yeah I've never done that so but yeah it can be done but it takes it takes a skill I do not possess so I might want to work on that off camera pushing the cars back and thanks for that suggestion I think it was uh, uber so you'll see him in my comments shout out to uber and shout out to anyone who leaves me a comment, uh, please, by all means, let me know what you think about my gameplay, uh, where I'm at, at what point in this, the game that I'm at. Um, I'm thinking we have two more weeks before Lifeline appears, and this will probably be it, be it for my breakdown series. I will switch over to Lifeline, but I, I'm not 100% sure at this time what I'm going to do with Breakdown. But rest assured, I will be bringing you Lifeline. Maybe three weeks in the beginning of June. And I can't wait. So we're back in home base. We're going to do some 
maintenance tasks. Um, with Evan, he's hurt, so we're gonna put back the pipe bombs and the fire. I'm going to hold on to this, but I'm gonna put this in there. And that'll give me a quick, quick influence boost if I need it in the future. I can just switch to Evan and plop that into the Enclave's supply locker. So we are going to switch out the shovel. And I'll get another sho shovel. I don't have another crusty shovel, but I do have a shovel. So we'll take that. And then we will switch to Amelia Craftsman. We are going to use Amelia Craftsman for the next couple of levels. I'm, I'm sorry, episodes. So that's it for this one. Thanks for watching, everyone. I hope you're enjoying my videos. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like my videos and do all that youtube -y stuff. All right, this is Kaz signing off. See you soon. Take care. Peace.